Linda Rodding. She's a model, entrepreneur, and stylist. She was a stylist for Victoria's Secret, Harper's Bazaar, and Vogue. She worked as a model in the 1960s and 70s. She began modeling again in her 60s, working with such brands as The Role. She built her own distinct style with silver hair, oversized sunglasses, and bold color lipstick. Not surprisingly, she has a lipstick brand with her name. As much as she wears a bright lipstick, she owns several colorful sunglasses. Wearing a bright color shirt, she looks so much younger than her age. Denim is another item Linda often opts for. It makes her look casual and young. She levels up a denim look with her big frame sunglasses and bold lipsticks. Leather jacket and trousers are also a frequent item for her. Because she has silver hair, wearing leather looks instantly chic. With very similar or probably the same green skirt and leather jacket, she styled different hairstyles, sunglasses, shoes, and socks. She brings out modern and trendy with a piece of metallic leather. A simple black long jacket is another trendy but timeless piece. Some people might say if you are over 50 or 60, avoid certain items such as leather and denim. Linda wears both denim and leather, and to me, she looks chic. She's not always wearing something quirky though. Classic design and soft color knitwear. Looks classy and expensive. More functional side of style, she opts for gilet. More pocket and make you warmer. What more do you want? Striped t-shirt or top, classic. and vertical stripes. Look at those white Majong Magella shoes. She's so trendy. I think she looks good in a feminine dress or skirt as well. With her untied long gray hair, she looks like someone from one of those fairy tales. But a quirky, bold, and somewhat girlish look is what makes Linda's unique style. By the way, I think bright blue or pale blue really suit her skin tone and her style as well. What do you think?